There is no hate, no bitterness, no frustration, just a resolute awareness of how things are, perfect in its nakedness, an acceptance of how things work, of how futile it is to try to mend, tailor, or customize a certain thought, a certain gesture, a cup of tea, or glass of wine to suit the palate of another, so deep in anguish. An anguish of want of possessions to replace love, of emotions sedated and hurt by ego and self-expectations, of limitations set by oneself for a tomorrow designed by others in the image of a prescribed future, where today is just another day, sacrificed habitually for the promise of a never-ending tomorrow.